Beer Time with Joe at Dragon Con, getting ready to have a hell of a good time. Go out around, drink some beer, and talk to some people. Y'all gonna love it? I will too. Beer Time with Joe here, and I have found Thomas. I found Thomas. Now, Thomas, where are you from? <sighs> About three miles that way. Three miles that way. Atlanta. There we go. Atlanta. Now, you and I are both enjoying uh, something good for breakfast. What, what are you enjoying for breakfast? I'm enjoying a delicious Moscow mule. Moscow mule. It's nutritious. It has lime juice. Exactly. Uh, ginger beer. Ginger is good for you. Always. And vodka, which is of questionable nutritious value, but, you know, enhances the vacation experience. Always. It always does. Uh, now, why are you a Dragon Con? Because it's fun. There we go. Why else would I be here? I don't think anything else more needs to be said besides that. I'll say, I'm, I guess I'm one of the few people that doesn't make it to any panel. I don't really go to any celebrity sightings. But, on the other hand, you know, the party atmosphere, the social aspect, makes it worth it in itself. Oh, definitely. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers, mate. You have a good one? You too. And we'll see you around con. We are in the hallway, the walking across the sky bridges, and we're going to uh, go to the main floor. See what's happening, see what's going on, see all the fun. And what are you drinking, Askin? I'm drinking Blue Moon. Who doesn't like Blue Moon? I think everybody likes Blue Moon. I, I love it. Now, why are you here at Dragon Con? Because I wanted to hang out with some awesome people, see some cool costumes, and go to school. Cool dance in this country. What's been the craziest thing you've seen since you've been here? I saw a guy that was dressed up as Waluigi from like the Mario yeah. universe and he had to have been seven feet tall and he was not stilts but he looked just like the character was awesome. There you go, awesome. Here and I found Nick. Nick, why are you at Dragon Con? Uh, because Dragon Con is awesome and I get to like dress up like a wizard warrior thing. And <laughs> there you go. And day drink and what? no one is shaming me for it. Who would do that? That's just me. Uh, church, church would do that. They, yeah, they would. Oh, uh, what are you drinking today? Uh, well, this is a sweet water. Okay, there you go. It's not. It would be my preference, but my preference is to not spend an arm and a leg for a beer. A beer. <laughs> exactly. Uh, how long you become a drink on? Since I was 16. 16, there you go. Yeah. Yeah. Good amount of time then. Yeah. I found Sarah. Now, Sarah, what beer are you drinking today? I am drinking PBR today. PBR. Caps Blue Ribbon. You gotta get Blue Ribbon. Blue Ribbon for doing something right. Is it? I guess so. Well, in the county fair, they give Blue Ribbon to the people who grew the best crops and whatever. True. There you go. I'm drinking uh, like some Bud Light. Why are you at Dragon Con today? Oh my god, I come every year. Every year? Every year. Why do you come every year? Because it's so much fun. You can hang out with your friends, cosplay. There you go. Yeah, have you been cosplaying today? Uh, not today, last night. Last and night. Tomorrow. Last night, tomorrow. Well, maybe we'll see you around tomorrow. Yeah, I'll be able to. I found Yuri. Hey, what are you drinking today, Yuri? I think it's wrong, but it could be vodka. We don't know. It's some kind of concoction, and it looks good and delicious. Yes, it does. What's your favorite thing about Dragon Con so far? Making costumes for it. There you go. How long have you been making costumes for Con? 14 years. 14 years. You got me beat. I've only been doing it for three. You got to catch up. You got it. I do. We got to do some work. However, if you were to have a beer, what kind of beer would you like to be drinking right now? Light and Light Chris, there we go. Yep. Beer time with Joe here, and I found Clint and Natasha. Whether those are real names or not, I really don't know. Okay, they're real names. Now, what yeah. kind of beers are y'all drinking today? So right now we're drinking whatever IPA they had at the stand. I'd never heard of it, but it's an IPA. So we're going to drink. Apocalypse IPA. Apocalypse IPA. IPA. Yeah. So that just must be chalk full of hops. Yes. <laughs> Really? Yeah, it's got a little fruit forward. It's got a little back end hop on the yeah. back of the throat. 
but it's not as full bodied as I'm used to in whatever. It, it, I mean, it's not as crisp and clean as a Bud Light, obviously. Obviously not. Yeah, no, definitely not as crisp and watery as a Bud Light, no. I, I was going to get a Bud Light or a water. I decided to go with water. I can't catch a break. No matter where I go, I just can't catch a break. <laughs> Now, who are you dressed as today? Uh, I have Hawkeye. Hawkeye? Black yeah. Widow. Black Widow. Yeah. Now, why do you go from Dragon Con? Uh, because it's fun. It is, like, people let loose of their normal boundaries and just yeah. be and, like, live in the moment. There you go. And yourself? Great people. Uh, and you meet people. people. Exactly. Like, beer time with Joe people. Cheers. This has been Joe. This is Clint. And Natasha. Real names? Yeah, we might find out. We might not. Cheers. We'll see you up the next one. Cheers. I'm yeah. with Joe here, and I found Ashley. What are you drinking today, Ashley? Angry Archer. Angry Archer. Now, why have you come to Dragon Con this year? Uh, I come every year. There you go. So, <laughs> but, 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 but why? Uh, it's like a festival of nerds. Everybody just comes and nerds out together and never happens anywhere else. And this is my home city, so I work here too, so I love it. There you go. What is, uh, if you were to be drinking a beer of choice right now, or cider of choice, what would it be? Angry Orchard. Angry Orchard, there you go. That's your favorite, you can't argue with that. Now, what's been the wildest thing you've seen since you've been here? Uh, there's a dude running around with no shirt on. He's not actually dressed in anything, he's wearing shorts, and he has Dragon Con badges and pins with him, and it's really weird. That, that is a little strange there. I've seen it like three times. <laughs> it's very bizarre. There you go. Well, I've been Joe. This is Ashley. This is some beer time with Joe. And we have found Walt and Alexa. Alexa. What are y'all drinking tonight? I am drinking a Moscow Mule uh, with some uh, Kroger ginger beer. and. Uh, <laughs> hey, there's beer in there. Right. Yeah. Close enough, right? Close enough for beer time with I'm Joe. drinking gin tonic, also powered by Kroger. Yeah, well, then there we go. A, they should be a sponsor. They, they should give us money. They need right? to give us money right now. I mean, if I if that's not a rock solid reason to give me money, I don't know what is. Exactly. Why why do y'all come to Dragon Con each year? I uh, mean, because it's a party. I mean, yeah. just look at this. Are you seeing this? I, I am. It looks damn good. Right. This is why I come to Dragon Con. It's a party. <laughs> right? Oh, my God. <laughs> What's been the craziest thing y'all have seen since you've been here? Oh, shit. Am I allowed to cuss on this show? Yeah. Okay. Uh, sh yeah. Okay, so uh, coolest thing is I do a Sith Lord Slave Leia, and I just played uh, volleyball in a pool as a Slave Leia. That was fantastic. That is amazing. Right? Like a bunch of chicks <laughs> in a chainmail bikini in a pool. I can't say I've seen anything crazy this year. I mean, the, the weekend's still early. It's yeah. only like Saturday. There's time. There right. you go, um, yeah. So you're about to get crazy. Yeah. <laughs> it is the, Saturday night the at The crazy dawn. is coming. The right? crazy yes, is, it is coming. <laughs> okay. You know what we found? Colton. Colton? Derek. And Derek, where are we right now? Dragon Con. Where's Dragon Con located? Downtown Atlanta. You can't pick a better spot for it, in my opinion. No, you really can't. So... What, what are we drinking now, boys? Uh, rum. Rum? What are you drinking? I got some porch punch. So, more rum, <laughs> and I'm drinking Bud Light. That's uh, something about Dragon Con. If beer is consumed, but not in nearly the amounts that rum is. Rum's kind of like a favorite around here. One, one of you agree? MVP, most definitely. You, you gotta have it. So, what's your favorite part about Dragon Con? Uh, definitely some just people watching. People watching. Derek? Um, I like how nice everybody is. Yeah, everyone's super friendly. I mean, everyone's nice to you, everyone's just having a good time. Okay. Uh, what's the craziest thing you've seen so far since you've been here, Derek? Dude, I... I I'd have to think about that one. I could, yeah. There's, there's been some crazy stuff. Man. Yeah, there, there has been there's some crazy, been some crazy stuff. stuff. What about you, Colton? I can't think of anything off my head. Really? I don't see anything crazy. Ooh, I know. Uh, last night when we were behind those people that had like the big mask on the top of their head and they were walking on the stilts and stuff. Uh, you know, oh, oh, that's cool. Yeah, I don't know what it was from, but man, it was. They were at least like eight or nine feet tall. On wow. Yeah, that's impressive. Walking on their hands and their feet. It was. It was wild. 
so just some of the crazy stuff you're going to see here at DragonCon. So, I'm Joe, Colton, there's Colton, Derek, there's Derek, and we'll catch up with y'all on the floor down... The beer, it's done. We're out of beer, porch punch. Don't worry, I got the Nalgene bottle full. We're going to go on the floor, interview some more people. So this went from beer time with Joe to rum time with Joe. And I have found the beers. Milwaukee's finest. Milwaukee's finest. What are y'all drinking tonight? Rum buckets. Buckets of rum. Well, I kind of made my own. It has mustaches on it. Oh, there you go. I'm fancy like that. How long y'all become a drying car? my 12th or 13th year. That's a long ass time. What inspired these fantastic beer costumes? The movie is amazing. There you go. What's your favorite beer? Julia's Irish Red. No, Angry Orchard. I'm not, I'm not a big beer guy. Hey, that, that's no problem. Well, we all drink what both like. That's right. And the best thing is cold and free. It's my favorite. There you go. What's the greatest thing you've seen here at Dragon Con besides yourself? Yeah, we're, we're kind of the craziest. We top everything. There's there a, you go. There's a pickle rick that's really amazing. Oh, there's a good pickle rick. That's all it is right there. So, I've been Joe. Yours, you are? Johnny. Johnny. Brian. Brian. This has been Beer Time with Joe, and we'll see y'all out in the floor somewhere. And as you know, it's not beer time, it's rum time. But you've run out of beer. Who have I found with me right here? Han Solo. I got Han Solo. And what are you drinking tonight? Rum and Coke. Right, just a classic combination. You can't go wrong with it. What's your favorite part about Dragon Con? The community of Dragon Con. Why do you, why do you keep coming back? Oh, because everybody fits in, and all my friends are here. Everybody's a friend. Where are we filming right now? In the Sky Bridge. Where we're not supposed to be filming. Keep that quiet. Well, thanks for letting me interview you. And who have I found? I found uh, the Miller Knight. The Miller Knight. How nice. awesome is that? Why are you? Why do you come drag con each year? Uh, because it's a place to show up, craftsmanship, and see everyone else have a great time. There you go. His friends are giving us the Celtic dance in the background, but it's not going to distract us too much. I don't know. No. <laughs> What inspired this awesomeness? Are you just a raging alcoholic or do you really like Miller Lite? Yes. Both! <laughs> That's a good answer. If it would me, be, it'd be Bud Light. What do you know? Hey. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're together. Yeah, we're exactly. Together. Now, I'm going to ask the stupidest question. What's your favorite beer? Uh, I actually like Orpheus Atlanta. No. <laughs> Look at him being all fancy and shit right now. Miller Lite! There we go. A good... Good beer, good solid beer. Right you, gotta stay, you gotta stay hydrated. You gotta exactly. stay hydrated. God. I, I'm drinking rum right now. That's not really like. No, it's not. not really like. You're right. You what, makes sense. What's your favorite thing about Dragon Con? Um, let's see. Uh, I like um, the, the feeling you come into Con. Yeah. You always look for the same feeling. You always get the same feeling, but then more. And I always keep you, go, uh, keep, keep you coming back. Right? It, exactly. Monday sucks. But Mondays keep you signed up for next year. Always, right. always, every year. I'm Joe. This is Scott, one of my old Dragon Con buddies. <laughs> and uh, we've run out of beer, haven't we? Almost. What are you drinking? I'm drinking Crown and Dr. Pepper. Crown and Dr. Pepper. I, I got what is more officially called Porch Punch. And so we're just. Sit back, drinking in the room. What floor are you on in the Marriott right now? The best floor. The first floor. The first floor. How the hell did you get first floor? We convinced the... I don't know. My wife did it. My wife is awesome. Your my wife is awesome. So, what's your favorite thing about coming to Dragon Con over here, Scott? Just seeing all the costumes. All the people. Not seeing me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's set my second best. Second best. Okay. I'll take second best. This has been Beer Time with Joe. Stay safe, drink safe, and we'll see you next time.
which aren't commonly used. Screw you, I already opened one. And I'm Joe. How's it going, Joe? What would you like to talk about?